So just to show evidence, so step 15 is to display the web page in your browser, if necessary, resize it so that all the page can be seen, all the text can be easily read, the dress bar is visible. And you'll see that there are going to be some evidence questions coming up. Okay, so let's just display the web page in your browser. Okay, so in front page to display it in the browser, just go to File, Preview in Browser, choose the first option, and it will open up in Internet Explorer or Firefox, etc. We'll just give this a few minutes to load. You can just say Ask Me Later. Okay, then what you can do is hold down Control, and you can scroll with your mouse in to make to zoom in or out to zoom out so i'm just going to zoom in just enough so that things are visible clearly visible and just going to make sure that we satisfy what they say over here or the page can be seen so this is clear that you can see the page all the text can be easily read looks like it and the address bar is visible so the address bar is visible i'm going to take a screenshot you go to your evidence document, this is evidence one. Okay, so this is, just to show you, this is take a screenshot of the browser window and place it in your evidence document. It's evidence one. It's gonna paste it and crop off what you don't need. So we need the address to be visible and we need the text to be visible. And there we go. And you can enlarge it if you want so that it's visible to the user. Remember, whatever you, whatever you print, the examiner marks. Okay, that's the first bit of evidence. Evidence 2, take a copy of the HTML source and place this in the evidence document. So what they mean there is of the web page that you're working on, you click on the code and you highlight all the code that's in this file, every single bit of code, and you go and paste it under evidence. This is evidence 2. Paste it there. So that's all you do, copy paste. And the last one, take a copy of your new style sheet and place this in your evidence document. Okay, so sometimes with the style sheets, okay, so for example, like this is the style sheet here. Sometimes they tell you to take a, a print screen or screenshot of your style sheet. So in that case, you have to print screen and then you would go and paste it under evidence three. So then you'd crop off what you don't need. So let's just pretend that we are going to take a screenshot of it as evidence. Then what you do is just enlarge it so that it's fully visible. Or if they say in this case, take a copy, then maybe what you could do is literally highlight copy. But I don't know how this would come out if you paste it comes out like that so I guess that is all right but most of the time you're going to see that it might say a screenshot must be taken but the copy paste just in case you need to know that um okay cool so that is evidence one two and three for this video